Dance has been an essential part of life and culture since the beginning. Ballet folklorico within the United States has helped Mexican Americans define their identity, celebrate their heritage, and form strong communal bonds. So what made me participate in the tradition is my uh, culture. I'm of Mexican descent and I grew up watching folklorico dances at parties, at events like at church. We would have folklorico dancers come and dance. So I always fell in love with like the, how the dresses flowed around and like the music too. What made me participate in this tradition is my Mexican culture and because it's part of who I am. I want to represent my culture of being Mexican and Hispanic and I want to learn more about the dances that are around in Mexico. Performances usually include dances representing different regions of Mexico. To express the essence of each region, directors utilize costumes, music, and movement. I am the computer instructional technician and folklorica advisor for Golden Valley High School. So folklorico has been around for many, many years. Every dance represents a different state, so that's why there's so many different um, outfits, dresses for each state. Folklorico is traced all the way back to ceremonial and social dances of indigenous people living in Mexico. Many regional dances currently performed existed as early as the 17th century, but were not firmly entrenched until after the 1810 War of Independence. So when I was a senior in high school, I got the experience to dance folklorico like my students here. So it was a lovely experience and I want my kids to have that experience themselves. At first I'm all nervous, but then once you go with the flow with it, it feels really nice and you get to show all the colors of the dress and inspire everyone. 